Welcome to School Focus. I'm your host, Melissa Payne. Most any teacher will tell you that different people learn in different ways. That's why Prince William County Public Schools operates some acclaimed alternative education centers that offer students who need non-traditional learning opportunities the chance to excel. To get a sense of how effective they are, just listen to the students and teachers of the New Directions Alternative Education Center. All of my teachers I've had I feel like they did a very good job. When I was at base schools, I've never passed an SOL. And this week, I passed all of my SOLs. Without like a locally verified credit, like I got a 400. I wanna go to college at first. I wanted to just hurry and get out of school so I can work. But here, they make you wanna try. They make you wanna have a better life. It made me actually have goals for myself and try to reach them. It's not as big as a regular school, but the teachers, they just want you to succeed and they will try to do anything to like make you succeed. I wasn't like social with people. Like when I first came here, I didn't speak with nobody. And then like, you know, over the years, I just got over it. Just started being myself, started being more comfortable. Like everybody here is like my family. Like my teachers are, like, you know, my female teachers are my moms. My male teachers are like a dad, you know father figure because my dad died when I was three. Mr. Icorn, to me, he's an amazing principal because he always makes sure the kids are doing good. He even touches bases with all the kids who are about to graduate because we have something called senior portfolio, which is where we do a resume, we do a, a few essays and stuff in it, and then we also plan our future in that one folder. We get it done, we, we have to go set up an appointment with him, we talk to him about it. Miss Williams is a hard-working English teacher, cares for her students like you're her kids. The students love her class. I'll be one of the first people in my family to graduate and you know it's a good accomplishment because my mom and my dad ever since I've been growing up like they always told me like oh I can't wait for you to walk across the stage we have so many different like plans for you. Knowing that they both never finished high school at least is going to make me feel like I'm doing better than what they did. Going here, you have an opportunity to have teacher talk classes. They usually give those to you when you have SOL classes. Those are just like regular classes like you would to be in high school. When you have online classes, you work on your own pace. You're not waiting on nobody else. It's up to you. If you don't do your classes, if you don't take the time out and do the work, it's not going to get done. And then at the end of the year, you'll be struggling. It is a lot of work and it is a lot of effort, but if you really want it that bad, you would do it. I'm glad to work for Prince William County. I'm glad that they have non-traditional education. I feel like I would have fit better in that myself. We always go f big on family around here, but we really try to care for them and get them jobs and really prepare them for you know the next step in their life. Um, and we've had you know of course a lot of support from Mr. Icorn and the whole administrative team, um, but he definitely plays a key role on that. We are living out our passion in a way that is impacting lives tremendously. And I think that it's just not us. I think that it's working together with the students in a manner that you build rapport. You only build rapport with trust and unconditional support that they see from us. It shows that here at New Directions that you have teachers that are going to go above and beyond in an alternative setting to facilitate that student to become their absolute best. This year, the New Directions Alternative Education Center will combine with New Dominion and Pace East to form the Independence Non-Traditional School under the direction of none other than Principal Bob Icorn. Its blend of programs, opportunities, and age groups will serve as a model for effective non-traditional education in the Commonwealth and across the country. It will give students with differing learning needs the opportunity to excel and to make the most of their abilities. It's positively PWCS because it will deliver on the commitment to provide a world-class education to each and every student. That's it for this edition of School Focus. Join us next time as we bring you more news and highlights from around the school division.